That's nice, look. There, the monk, the, the temple dog. Yeah, coconut, cocoa. Right, come to play with this little boy here, yeah? He's just playing with him. He's just run off. But yeah, that's nice, that look, you know. Pretty good, that, isn't it, with the old... Um... You OK? Hey, come to play, haven't you? You must have followed me out here, and that's how you got to, to here to play with him. You're a follower, are you? You follow. You okay, coconut? Yeah? Oh, he's got a little smile on her face as well, haven't you? Oh, that's so good, look. It's all, oh, she's having a little lick there with a little play. Oh, she's smiling and everything. Oh, it's really good, that is. That's it, play. Oh, that is brilliant. Never seen her do that before, playing. Yeah, I know, look at that. Oh, I've seen her do this before, a little bit. She was doing that this morning, licking me. Hello. Ma. Yeah, well, ni ni ma ben ma uh, wa. Pum kamoi, pum kamoi ma jack wa. Ah. She was just saying there, you've got all different, you know, all, all different sizes of uh, of, of dog, even the small ones. No, but you're a lovely one, you are, aren't you? Hey, walking around. We have a little splash there. They have got us some brevecto. You know, and all these dogs have got brevecto, and that's why they're not scratching and eating themselves, because they've, they've got no ticks or, or fleas. But she hasn't had that brevecto. I bought, the, I bought it for her. But... Um, She's probably about five kilos. I've got five to ten kilo. I'm just not going to give it all, all of her. I'll give her half. Yeah, I've got to be. There's lots of people say, well, not I say lots of people. There are people who say Brevecto is dangerous and it poisons dogs. But I'd give these for over a year, these dogs have had. Like him there, this dog, right, Scamp, he's beautiful. Everyone loves him, right? He's a bloody lovely one, yeah? Right, but. He's got, look at his hair, it's beautiful, look, you know, all this, right? He would have no hair if I didn't give it to him. He comes out with, he has little, little scabs all over his body, open sores, I know, and all this, and he's got no fur around his eyes, anything. He's, you know, he's a mess, right? People would just kick him, right? They go, oh, kick that dog. Is that dog over there, kill and kick it, right? And she's got no problems. Oh, that's good, that is, look at her. Oh, that's really good. But then again, she's had lots of food today. I've given her meat three times today. They've all been thinking, well, what have we done? Why aren't we having meat? Oh, that's good. She's not sick now, is she? That's it. That's I think she's going to be happy. That's the main thing. So, Gork, are you going to look, you going to look after her, eh? What's she doing there? She's got something dripping out of her mouth. Cause she's a she's a bugger for uh, for uh, licking frogs. Messy. She loves playing with frogs, and some of them have got poison on them. He ends up, they end up, she ends up just like a foam foaming from the mouth. Not sick or anything, but just like, oh, that wasn't a good idea, was it? Type of thing. Oh, and then Tan's coming. He wants to come and say, "Hello, Tan, Tan. <coughs> Bloody lovely one, you are." Oh, he's moaning now. Yeah. Because he's not, he used to be the, the the big guy. Then I went and brought this. I befriended this white one that used to run around. It's got it has got an owner I've heard, right? But the owner's all the way over there, miles away. Well, not miles, but you know, a good walk over there. But he used to hang around it because of our females. And then I was like, oh, it's interesting. What's that? And I wanted to, I wanted to pat him, right? But that worked out then. That's a, dang, bit. Come my. Is that seeing? Me seeing then? No, it's just a seal. Bit seeing then. See, see. Ah, do you remember that? See, then. Batterly. 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 Come on, Oh. Come on, lie down. Oh, okay, right, yeah. Mum, do you need help? Yeah, this is what you see. This little mate she's got here. 
He's a little mate. Dan sort of goes, oh, great, come on. Oh, that's good. I bought him for that yesterday. He's trying to break it already. Yeah, he's a little mate. It's the only problem. It's a nook, Mark. He, he, he orders his mate around saying, look, you're coming to play in our house, so you're going to come and play to my rules, right? My house, my rules. The thing is, this kid hasn't got any toys at all. And when he comes in, he sees all Dang's toys. Bloody lovely, you well, are, aren't you? Coconut, Coco. Doesn't know a name yet. Oh, bloody lovely, you well, are, aren't you? <laughs> I know, you're bloody lovely. Yeah, and you're a lovely one as well, aren't you? That's it. Oh, that's good. Look, she's coming to say hello to everybody. No. Hmm? Dang. Oh, here we go. He's going to now. I bet he's going to say that Bomb's done something wrong. Because when he used to see this Bomb, boy, he ain't got no toys. So when he comes here, he has to say, he, he sees all the toys. He's like, oh, my God. He ain't got no interest in playing with Dang. All he wants, he sees guns. He sees little tractors and toys and that kind of stuff. I bought him. He goes, oh, I'll play with this. You know, I've got no interest. Hey, look, is he in the... <laughs> he's hiding. Mm, well, that was... Mm, that's a bit of a weird one, that, because he shouldn't be in the house for a starter. All right. But, um... What are they going to have an argument? He's asked him to come round and play, you see, but he's not interested in playing. He's... I like it, Bob. Oh, dang. Let's have a look. He's come in the house on his own and walked into the bedroom to start to... Playing on his own with the to all the toys. Mm. All right, Bam. Okay, Bam. Mm, I like Ken. Look, he's never seen anything like it in his life. Yeah. If I wasn't there, to steal everything, he'd have he'd have no toys left. You know what I mean? And he's got so many toys, Dang, that you probably wouldn't even notice they've gone. Like if I wasn't there now, that toy, and Dang was just playing on his own, and kids came round as they wanted to, that'd go. There's no, he couldn't control them. They just, they just disappear. That would. Like he's gone in the room on his own. And taken, and taken that. So he's just, tell, he's just telling him there, like uh, you're not allowed to take that out. So it's a problem you got, you saying. If I'm not here, if I wasn't here, he'll end up having no friends. This is the problem. It's a bit, it's a, diff it's a difficult balance, isn't it, between what people, even what people are like. But this, um, this kid here before, when I was in England once, looking on the camera, looking on the camera from England, and then it, it was in the morning, and this, and this kid here, yeah, Came into here when no one was here and stole a, um, a big, a big, um, big trap. What was it? A big, um, a big excavator. Yeah, you know, like a, like a decent sized excavator. I bought it down. I'd sent in the post from England, and uh, and he came and stole it. I watched him pick it up and stick it. And he went. He run off down the street. And then his mom and I watching. I'm shouting on the camera. Come back, come back. And then his mom, well, his mom, his grandmother who looks after him because his mom. He probably hasn't seen his mum and dad for a long, long time. They'll be away working somewhere in another country. And uh, and she came. And I saw her come back, drag him by the ear roll and come back with the thing and dump, dump the thing back, back in the sandpit where it was. Yes. Um, yeah, this kid is not... He's, he's, they're all problematic, you say, because they're all thick as shit as well. They've had no... They've got no one... All the... All the, what, the, look, the kids, the people looking after them are their grandmothers and grandfathers. Their mums and dads are nowhere. They haven't seen them for years. They're back there away working in different countries, maybe working down uh, in the south of the country. You know what I mean? So, and they end up, a lot of them, like that one, that kid there, he can hardly speak. He hardly says any words. You know what I mean? That's where Dang's like, I have conversations with him. It's, yeah, they're a weird bunch. And you can guarantee, you get like, say, three or four of them. If you had three or four kids around here, like there will be in the, in the years to come. There'll be like maybe five, six, ten kids here, ha, here, right? They'll just leave. They'll just talk between themselves and say, right, we're having this, we're having that, we're having that. It's kids, isn't it? I mean, what can you do? Yeah. Control them, ain't you? Anyway, there we go. Life in the village.